hey everyone welcome back to my youtube channel i am back with this video and today we're gonna be working a um holiday season christmas i can say um design um if you follow me on tiktok some of you already have seen this design but i'm gonna go ahead and just share with you guys um i know it's it's gonna be a little bit late but i said let's just go ahead and upload it for you guys so i am gonna start using these um curve and nail tips i know everyone's going crazy over uh social media about the tapered square nail tips i am going to be using these c curve nail tips i also went a little bit crazy as well you guys i'm not gonna lie i went ahead and bought like two to three boxes of the um supposedly it said tapered squared but when i received them i did see that they were c curved so what i'm gonna go ahead and do with these ones i'm gonna go ahead and just uh cut the number off and then to make that perfect perfect taper square that i want i am gonna go ahead and cut um on the side of each nail tip i know also i have seen like when you go on a website of a company that they're selling nail tips um this is just my personal fact please do not comment me wrong i'm just saying um it does say in the description like just regular um tapered square nail tips but when i like i said when i receive them they do have that c curve and i literally never never use c curves because i hate them i just do hate c curve nail tips and um well i said let's give it a try and see if these c curve um nail tips will work for me so if you're a beginner i know you guys are you guys are probably going crazy buying um, the taper square nail tips um but trust me um if you are gonna buy these nail tips just go ahead and cut the sides i know some of the companies might say that um they do not cut the sides to make that perfect shape well i do and that's what i did for this design i want to go ahead i went ahead and cut the sides and started um filing all that mm, shine of my nails of the of the nail tip and i it's so satisfying just um seeing my nail tips just um super buffed out without that shine i'm just giving you my personal option you guys please do not come at me wrong you guys i'm just saying um because this had happened to me where i saw the perfect tapered squared um nail tips that i said on the description and i read the whole thing but it never said c curve tapered squared nail tips so yes you guys this is all i'm doing just cutting the sides to make that perfect perfect tapered square um if you're a beginner this is going to be a little bit harder for you guys um because because when it comes to the acrylic application you might want to keep on adding and adding um acrylic and it's just going to turn out bulky but even though if you go back and file i don't know you guys but if you will love to try the tapered square um this is what i used i used the c curve um nail tips but i just wish that they made like the regular nail tips but tapered square without the c curve and i also wanted to let you guys know that only because i said do not use it doesn't mean you're not gonna use it you guys you could go ahead and use it use whatever works best for you use whatever is best for your satisfying um you can use the coffin tip you can use whatever tip you desire i'm just giving you my personal option and what has worked for me um so yeah so you guys can go ahead and achieve your perfect shape or that perfect design the perfect tapered square that's just my option you guys so yeah you guys are free to use whatever you guys want to and this is just what i used for to achieve that tapered square so after i am done um, buffing um, removing all that dust out of my nails now I'm gonna go ahead and start applying the acrylic and for this design I decided to go with a brown acrylic yes I know a brown like who uses brown on the Christmas holiday like what the heck I know you guys um, but I wanted to try something new um, I went ahead and I started using this clear um, neutral acrylic on my cuticle area and then went with brown 
okay you guys that's enough of me talking i do not want to make you bored watching this video of me blabbering and all the whole thing throughout this video so i'm gonna go ahead and let you watch the application and then whenever i need to come back and explain a little bit more about this design i'm gonna go ahead and come back okay you guys so keep on watching and i will be back soon
Okay, you guys, so after I was done applying all the acrylic application, now I started buffing my nails with my drill bit. And I am using a sanding bit that is a medium coarse bit, so I am gonna um, file my nail bits with this bit. Now, after this, I did decide to use one of my own uh, nail stickers. Um, I do have them available on my Etsy shop. Um, this exactly one this white one is not available the reason being why is because i do not have white right now i am waiting for um some new items to arrive so soon the white ones will be available i do have some pink ones and blue ones and then the aqua blue um snowflakes I could not remember what exactly acrylic brand did I use from because these acrylics are from different brands. I just wish I should have told you guys but I couldn't remember. I did also add a Chanel sticker in the middle where I did like a fade. Um, that's pretty much all I'm going to do to this design and I'm going to add a little bit of rhinestones or I probably I'll just leave it plain. So I did change my mind. I went ahead and added some of the rhinestones and you guys when I was adding the rhinestones first I thought I was recording but I wasn't. I apologize for that. I wish I, I was recording that part but here's the final result of this design. I really hope you guys enjoy this design. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe and share this video so more ladies can join this beautiful channel of mine of my creations and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye guys. Take care. Thank you.